Oh, so that's it, huh? That's how you took the starter out of the back from Bowser. It seems like another wild adventure in the books, bro. The castle's back in its normal place, and everyone's returned home safely. You came through in the end, just like you always do. I know you've been back for days now, but I bet you still kind of feel like you're on an adventure, don't you? That reminds me, the pals who traveled with you. I wonder what they're up to now. Ouija! Nobody ever pays attention to Ouija. New Mario! It's Paracary! Hooray! Hey, Paracary, what's up? I thought you were back at work delivering letters. Ha ha ha, I sure am! This isn't a social call. I dropped by bringing a letter to you, Goombario. It's from Princess Peach. Peach! Huh? From Princess Peach? Whoa, what's she writing me for? We didn't find out, I've got to deliver more letters! Thanks, Paracary. See ya. Keep working hard, buddy. Take care. Ha <laughs> ha, you're awesome. No, I'm just kidding. Um, hey, Goombario. What did Princess Peach write in the letter? Let me see. Hang on, Goombaria. This... This is unbelievable. She gave all the credit to Mario? Urgh, rage! No. What is Bombette doing in the Koopa? Uh, Pelberg, I believe. And then, Bootler, hoo hoo hoo, so very funny, cause it's punny, gives her a letter. Then Watts gets a letter. Yep, I don't know what Watts doing back in the Shy Guy toy box. And then Sushi's back at Yoshi Island. Yoshi's Island. Stupid kids running around. Uh, Yoshi kids. Lackluster. <laughs> no. Oh, Colorado. And what's this? Coops, or Cooper, I still forget what his name is. I'm pretty sure it's Cooper, though. Yeah, leave it to me. I know the place to the... Oh, whatever. Yep, it's Cooper. Okay, I was right. Huh? Paracary brings you here. Phew, I finally made it. I have a letter from Princess Peach. Here you go. Read it so fast that no one else on the... Uh, no other viewer can see it. Oh, that's very interesting. Hmm. Well, I'm already past the time limit, but... Whatever, because I'm just going to cut things out and then put it in credits, so, yeah, that's how it's going to happen. Hooray, we win. Hooray, hooray. Huh, did you hear something outside? I think I did. Let's go take a quick look. That's right, you better leave. And he comes back with a letter. Hey, bro, guess what? Belkill, he stopped by to drop off a party invitation in in from Princess Peach. He said that it, he's also inv invited to the party, so he took off and said he's at... Uh, wait, uh, no. I cannot speak. Ouija fails. Poor Ouija. Nobody ever listens to Ouija. So we get to see this grand cutscene going to the castle. Except this time, this cutscene won't be. Well, actually, it's not really a cutscene because you obviously see me moving. But um, this time we're not going to see the, the destruction of the castle. We're actually going to go reunite with some old friends. And uh, you can see Gumbario is back there, and there's Colorado with his lovely wife. No, I'm just kidding. She's not that lovely. Then you see some Yoshi, some penguins, some boos, some nomadi mice, the Yoshi chief. We step inside. And Mario, welcome to the castle. Princess Peach should be here very shortly. And now, Princess Peach! Dun da da dun dun da dun da da dun 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 the Star Rod, sold by Bowser, has been returned to Star Haven. Peace has once again returned to the Mushroom Kingdom. Above us, the stars shine with more beauty and power than ever before. It seems that they're sending us their thanks. Mario. Goombario, Koopa, Bombat, Paracary, and all those other people we don't care about. Thank you very much indeed. 
I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I hope that the Mushroom Kingdom will enjoy peace and prosperity for a long time to come. Perhaps forever! Ha! <laughs> oh god, that was a good one, forever! Oh, but seriously, this is my heartfelt wish. Except for that forever part, that's just... No, that's just obscene. So, let's celebrate! Enjoy the festivities, everyone! And thank you, my viewers, for watching! Now you're gonna watch me, and... Actually, you're gonna watch me... Actually, you're gonna... You're gonna... Alright, credits begin. Ah, I never thought I'd see this. The credits of the game. And Luigi, pretending to be the marching band leader. Freestyle rap! Freestyle rap! No, but I'm... You get to see the slow march with all the people who were in the game. And you get to see the credits. So I'm gonna turn off my WaveBird controller. My WaveBird Nintendo controller. And I'm gonna watch as we watch the march. And as you see the Star Haven Starships there. Ryoto... Uh, Ryoto Kawade. Director. Toshitaka Muru... Muromatsu. Ooh, boy. No. Excuse me. Takahiro Oki. 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 Hehe. <laughs> Director. Ronabu Suzuki. Ooh, Suzuki. Suzuki. Suzuki! And there's Chuck Quizmo. Script writers. Kumiku Takeda. Kaori. Aoki. And there's the Koopa Bros. Hee! <laughs> Perhaps my favorite boss in this game. Well, bosses, because they're just that awesome. Oh, uh, boy. And then they got their little paper mache bows or whatever. In the background, you see the whale. Remember, he's a mammal. He's not some fish. He's not a tuna. And there's Colorado and Colorado's wife, and they're waving to us in the background while being lifted up by the blowhole of the whale. And that you know, doesn't sound right. And then there's the bad shop people. And you meet the nomadi mouse. Mice, rather. And there's Tut and Koopa still being chased by his chain drum. And I love pointing out the obvious because it's just so much fun. Ooh, dang on. Ooh. Hmm. Could that be signifying something in future games? Perhaps so. And there's Klepto. The vulture. And I believe his name is Klepto. But you can correct me if I'm wrong. And there's Bootler. And there's more chain drums. <laughs> no, this music's actually pretty cool for uh, marching music. His tubble blubber, his empty shell, and his heart. That's a bit disturbing. <laughs> Let's go along with it, it's Nintendo. There's the Goomba King and the red and blue Goombas. That's funny. I remember we- Oh! Huh. And actually, if you notice that, um... The bosses pretty much almost signify how to defeat them. Uh, only some bosses, like, um... Uh, the Koopa Bros and the Goomba King. And then, Tubba Blubba didn't really show anything, but... There's the Raven. I believe his followers should be up. Look at that. Yoshi's Island gets its own... Low, so you get Yoshi in an island. It's it's so cute. No. But what makes them so special to put Yoshi on their floats and have color-changing text? That's that's fair. What about the other floats? They don't get special text. And there's a Yoshi kid starting more trouble. And of course he's moving without a moving his legs. And there's Huff and Puff. Faggot. I don't like him. I don't like him a lot. I don't like him at all. And there's Gourmet Guy! Ha! Ah, uh, Yoshi kids, you're up to no good once again. And then, Gourmet, Gourmet Guy just goes there, he's like, Mmm! And And then there's a Crystal King, approaching down the aisle with royalty. Fatality. Oh, there's another what? I have a feeling one of them is a freak sheet. That's right, there's the real Crystal King. What? There's another one? Confound it! I swear to god, if there's one more. 
No, that seems to be the real crystal. Yep, real crystal king. And his crystal bits just take him away. Junior Troopa in his mage outfit. Battling Kami Koopa. That's... This may be my actually favorite scene of the credits. Because, I mean, they put so much action into it. It's pretty cool. And then there's the hammer bros juggling their two hammers. Not much skill, really. Then there's Bowser just chilling. He's like, oh man, I'm a pimp. I'm a pimp, I'm a pimp. And, oh, Junior Troopa, what did you do? Oh, but Bowser's like, oh, I was defeated by Mario, I don't care. And as he leaves screens, he rage. He just rages and destroys his enemies. And then you have the seven star spirits. They're here to say... Oh, no, that's their floats. They're not here. Oh, special thanks. They're giving... The Seven Star Spirits are here to signify the special thanks to people who contributed to this game. Then there, there's the penguins. I love the penguins, they make me feel like a special person. Oh no! That's better. He <laughs> he you didn't see that. No, not even. Uh yep. So they got the orchestra there. And then there's a lady from Club uh 64. That's a pretty sick keyboard. And then there's the Maisy Daisies. Rage at the memories I've had. Uh, pain in my ass, Maisy Daisies. And then you've got, um, all the Merlin, or you got Merlin's family there. And, yep, and then the ancestor. And then the sun, then the glowy, uppy tree. And if you haven't noticed, it turned into night. Yes, that's how you say it. And special thanks to the Super Mario Club, which is a beta testing uh, club or group for Nintendo games. At least that's what I believe it is. If it's something different, please notify me, but I'm pretty sure they're the beta testers of pretty much every Nintendo game. Then you've got a little dance here with General Guy and then the Dancer Guys. following the music and I don't care because there's a shy guy ha you fell you fail whoa how do they make their heads glow up like that and producer Shikuru Miyamoto Shikuru Miyamoto Shikuru Miyamoto that's fun to say you should try it people Shikuru Miyamoto Oh boy, I get a kick out of that. Ooh, Mario's on his own float. Of course he would. He'd get the best float in the game. But not the best part. The best part is Junior Troopa and Kami Koopa. And the win by a lot in my book. But here you go, 2001 Nintendo. That, this is signifying goodbye and... Thank you so much for playing my game. Well, rather... I, I know this is cliche, but uh, thank you so much for watching my Let's Plays. <laughs> I had to do it. Anyways, it was a game by Intelligent Systems, if you didn't know that. But I'm pretty sure you did. Unless you're too lazy to watch part one, but... Part one sucks. <laughs> Anyways, here you go. Fireworks at the end. The end. Well, that was an interesting Let's Play, I must say. For my first Let's Play, I am intrigued, and I will do more now. That was very good, and I'm glad you guys liked Paper Mario. If you didn't, well, you should. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. It's alright. Everyone is allowed to have their own opinions, but, um, that's the end of the game, and it'll just keep on running like this until you eventually shut it off, because all Nintendo games do that, and I, or Nintendo 64 games, and I don't know why. It bothers me, but I'm shutting off my Wii now. So now you just see a black screen, and, well, there you go, guys. I'm glad you like this and if you didn't well i'm glad you viewed and once again thanks for subscribing thanks for watching and i'll see you guys my next let's play ciao